move over Wally, its heart robot who's now winning admirers. And the secret of his success, his ability to respond to the humans he encounters. Created by the UK's Bristol Robotics Laboratory, this vulnerable looking puppet robot has a breathing belly and a beating heart that slows when he's calmed. He'll also clasp your hand if you reach out to touch him. Hart has been interacting with visitors at London Science Museum. One said holding him was like holding her own baby. The only difference was it was lighter, but the actual feeling of holding a baby, it was, it was just lovely. And it was, and you felt, you felt emotional towards it. It was, it was lovely. But is it a good thing to emotionally bond with a machine? That's the question Hart's creators and project coordinator David McGoran want to explore. If it's this easy to get people to have such a strong reaction with such simple technology, then what kind of a world is it going to be when advanced technology is put into our machines to draw us into having an emotional relationship with them? What kind of society, what kind of people will we become? With toys coming on the market that can emulate behaviours and even read emotions, McGoran says it's still unknown whether they can help a child be more or less emotionally savvy. But recent research has explored how robots could possibly help autistic children improve their social skills. Matt Denton, whose insect-like IC hexapod is also on display here, believes robots can play a positive role in our relationships. Why not? It's a, it's a nice thing that you can you get attached to your car, so why not get attached to something that gives you more feedback than a car, you know, a robot? It looks like these robotics fans would certainly agree. We'd well, love to have one, yeah. <laughs> wow. Michelle Clara, Hoodie.